All right, hello everybody, and welcome to the new Pokemon game, Taking the World by Storm. This is Poke Rogue. It is a browser-based Pokemon roguelike that Nintendo is almost sure to destroy in a matter of, I don't know, probably days. I'd give it days. So yeah, make sure you play it while you can. Welcome to Poke Rogue. This is a battle-focused Pokemon fan game with roguelite elements. I'm gonna go ahead and give this thing a try. This game is not monetized and we claim no ownership of Pokemon nor the copyrighted assets used. The game is a work in progress but fully playable. For bug reports, please blah blah blah. If the game runs slowly, yeah yeah yeah. Okay, we're gonna uh, we're, we're gonna go with that and uh, we're gonna do, do a fresh run. Um, ooh, some Pokemon Mystery Dungeon music, nice. Yeah, so for, for those of you just jumping in with me, uh, my, my Pokemon history, I, I used to play competitively back in, like, Gen 4, I want to say. It's been a long time. It's been a very long time. But, um, yeah, I've always loved Pokemon. Played through pretty much all of them growing up. And, uh, yeah, obviously these days I've graduated to playing a lot of roguelikes. Not just uh, your mystery dungeons and whatnot. But, um, yeah, we're, we're, we're just going to give it a go. I'm going to figure out what's going on here. Um, I don't know how this this controls yet. Like, it's, it's weird. Okay. Each starter has a value. Your party can have up to six members as long as the total value does not equal ten. You can also select gender, ability, and form dependent on the variants you've caught and hatched. The IVs for species are also the best of everyone. Okay, cool. You've caught or hatched. Oh, wow, that's so cool. So you, you don't auto get, like, perfect. That's great. So try to get lots of the same species. Awesome. Okay, so... How many generations do we go up to? Well, okay, so we, we go all the way. So that, that's pretty sweet. And they, they have... They're all worth three, I guess. Um... I'm definitely going to get Fue Coco, because Fue Coco is great. I actually really like them. Um, so we're going to grab that, and we'll go with the Firewater Grass Core. I guess I could go for, like, a a more offensive setup. We're, we're going to grab Mudkip, because Mud Mudkip's also crazy. Just like a broken little guy, for sure. And... Hmm... I don't really know grass types as well. I, I just know, like, Venusaur and Torterra. We'd have dual ground if we went with Torterra. Should be good offensively, but bad defensively. Um, hmm, I don't know. Grookey's pretty sick. Grookey was the one that I picked on my my playthrough. Yeah, let's go with Grookey. And that, and that puts us at nine, so that's the the most we're gonna be able to get. Let's go ahead and begin with these guys. I don't know if the mouse is useful at all. Oh, here we go. We got a cat. We're just going straight into it. To access the menu, press M or escape while waiting input. The menu contains settings and various features. Okay. Um, let's see. What do we have? Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. We got a, a whole bunch of... Ah, what have I done? The illusion. My illusion! Okay. Um, okay. Egg gotcha. This is egg gotcha. You can redeem your vouchers for eggs. Oh my god, there's gotcha. That's so sick. I love that. Love me some some free gotcha. That's, that's what it's all about. Okay. Uh, alright. Sweet. Yeah, so this game just controls with Wazd. I'm, I'm gonna turn this game down a little bit for, yeah, for both of us by the looks of it. I think that's what I need to do. Um, so just give me one moment to do that. Alright, this should be a little bit better. Let's go ahead and get into it. We got a fighting type with Ember, so this is, this is yeah, easy peasy. Easy peasy, one hit KO. Don't mind if I did. And we get to choose between rare candy, nugget, or lure. Interesting. How did the... I'm still trying to figure out how the controls work. After every battle, you're given... A choice of three random items. These range from consumables to Pokemon held items to passive permanent items. Most non-consumable item effects will stack in various ways. 
Some items will only show up if they can be used, such as evolution items. You can also transfer held items between Pokemon using the transfer option. The transfer option will appear in, in the bottom right once you have obtained a held item. You may purchase consumable items with money, and a larger variety will be available the further you get. Be sure to buy these items before you pick your random items, as it will progress to the next battle once you do. Increase a Pokemon's level by one. Um, let's see if I can... Still trying to learn how to navigate this thing. So this is a rare. <clears throat> and I imagine Nugget... Nugget's probably going to be worth like a thousand, right? It, it says 180, but like that doesn't seem right. Hmm. Doubles the chance of an encounter being a double battle for five battles. So that would grant me a bunch of extra XP. A revive would be nice to have as well. I don't know if this means that it only grants you 180 money. Like, that seems so low. Rare candy does seem pretty decent. I'm... Hmm. Hmm. Oh, this is the shop. This this is what costs money, and these are what give... And these are the freebies. I understand now. Okay. Cool. Well, I guess we'll buy... Oh, we, we, we can't just store potions, I see. So th those are for purchase. We're going to grab that and just take the extra money. That's an Abra. God damn. Um, do I want to fight Abra with Fuecoco? Yeah, I think that's fine. I should probably be using Tackle. Yeah. It, oh, wow, we got a double battle. Cool. Okay. Um, nah, this is good. This is good. We'll We'll just... Focus down. I, I think Lillipup is probably going to be slightly more dangerous, so we'll go after that one first. We got the burn. Very nice. Very nice. Not too shabby. Alright. Yeah, Astonish. Not that big of a deal. But yeah, I'm, I'm interested to see how long this lasts, because like this, this is like... This is infinite entertainment. Like, the fact that it's free is so great. Okay, so nuggets become worth more the higher level uh, they become. That that's good. Um, once again, double battles are pretty good for XP. I'm gonna go ahead and take a lure. We've got a Lechonk. Um, we're just gonna get our our Fue Coco leveled up for now. I think that's that's step number one. Getting that that level up would be really good. Definitely taking a lot of damage though, so we're probably gonna have to swap out soon. So yeah, I'm just using WASD to control the game with um, Spacebar, and that's it. Enigma Barry. Restores 25% HP if hit by a super effective. Ooh, it's a little specific. We could also get some Pokeballs. Uh, increasing our team that way would be really good. Ooh, Suzette. I don't recognize you. How about a battle? All right. Um, Poochiana. Okay. Um, we can take a hit. We'll be fine. Yeah, he just he went for the the silly play. It'll it'll probably let me swap out here, depending on the switch rules. Bidoof at level four. Don't think he gets water gun yet. Yeah, play play Coco. Just just keep burning everyone. It's fine. There we go. Blaze is active. We got that RTSR strat going. Very nice. Alright, two levels on Fue Coco. Looking good. Uh, I hope we get a chance to have a rematch someday. And we got 120, 110 money for that. I'm going to go ahead and potion up here. Get, the, get that heal going. That's pretty optimal. Uh, super potion or rain dance. I definitely want to hold on to rain dance. But I have to teach it right away to Mudkip, huh? Um, <clears throat> I mean, we might be able to get some like really crazy stuff going if we if we take Rain Dance. Whoa, Minchino's the good guy. So that's, that's a good unit. Get like um, it's round. Oh, this is a um, I know this move. This is a doubles move. Interesting. 
Interesting. Uh, does Ember Oko here? We'll see, I guess. It does not. Do we want to try and ball out here? Give it a go. A little bit scary. Nice! There we go. Minchino has Pound, Baby to All Eyes, and Helping Hand. So it'll be it'll be good in uh, doubles battles. Which is good. <clears throat> and scales up pretty well, too. Lumberry is amazing. I do love Lumberry quite a lot. I think that's what we'll take. And we will throw that on... Mudkip, because I'm, I'm going to start leveling Mudkip next here. Oh, it's a Cottony as well. Oh, man. Well, I guess we're, we're going to keep using our fire and just burning things down for now. Um, obviously, like, Leech Seed shenanigans could be pretty crazy if we want to go that line. And we do have them set up for, like, a free capture. We'll go for it. Why not? Why not? There we go. Now got Cottony available for the early game, which is great. Nugget is worth 240 now, which is decent. Um, I think that makes a lot more sense than a potion ever would, I must say. Um, these being lasting over five battles is quite good, but we're very early game, so we can take our time. There you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Did you forget to say goodbye to your best friend? I don't know who you are! You're going after your dream, huh? That day is really today, isn't it? Anyway, I'll forgive you for forgetting me. But on one condition, you have to battle me. Give it your all. Wouldn't want you, your adventure to be over before it started, right? Uh-oh. Oh, oh she, she's only got two mons. She's only got two mons. Uh-oh. She does have a... Okay, we're gonna insta-switch to Grookey, who I have literally not used yet. There we go. And, uh, we don't have a grass move! <laughs> okay, alright, we're doing, we're doing this, I understand. Um, these two are already low, which is not great. Grookey is my win con against their, uh... Their one mon. Whoa, that was a lot of damage. Holy shit. Um, am I faster than this bird? Am I gonna get blown out by it? Okay, he's going for growl. That's that's very convenient for me. Okay, nice crit. Definitely a little bit of hacks. Okay, we got a range. That's awesome. We're in torrent, which is also good. Let's see how this goes. Mudkip V. Uh, Mudkip, oh Mudkip, do we do this? I don't think so. Um, how do you back out of moves? Uh, I, I changed my mind. I don't want to do this. Let me out. Let me out! <laughs> I changed my mind. I don't want to pick a move. <laughs> ah, what's happening? Oh my god. Okay, we're, we're fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> how do I... How do I back out? I'm, okay, we're just mud. We're sacking Mudkip. I've decided that's what's happening. Rock Smash. Okay, we, we've scouted Rock Smash. That's good. Mingino probably doesn't want to come out into that. Oh man, Cottony has Absorb, but I'm gonna be slower, like guaranteed. Well, it outsped my Fue Coco. Maybe it won't be slower. My Fue Coco is a higher level. Uh, let's, let's just hope. Yeah. Even, even if we get, like, some damage this way, I'm, I'm pretty happy. It's no big deal. I'm hoping we get, like, a, a, like, a, the, the, one, of, one of those things where you heal all your mons. That would be great. It would be really good if we get one of those at some point. Oh, man, Mudkip's getting into that kind of range. That kind of range, you know the one. That torrent range. Okay, here we go, tackle. I don't know if tackle's better than... All right, that was uh, <laughs> genuinely terrifying. I was not prepared. You just started out and you're already this strong? You totally cheated, didn't you? Just kidding. I lost fair and square. I have a feeling you're going to do really well out there. By the way, the professor wanted me to give you some items. Hopefully they're helpful. Do your best. Like always, I believe in you. All right, bunch of money and a super EXP charm and EXP all. Convenient. We got a rare candy. Um, 
or some more balls. We, we got a decent amount of... I think I got like two balls already. Oh, we gotta revive our guys, don't we? That's awkward. Um, we're gonna max everybody out with, with health, because that's cheap. What? Oh, here we go. Okay, that's good. Do I revive? Like, I guess sacking is really bad. Okay, we're gonna use a rare candy uh, as a revive tech on uh, Mudkip. There we go. So that should give them the HP. They learn Rock Smash, huh? Uh, we're definitely gonna get rid of Growl. We're not. We're not really. It, like it, you know, there's a, there's a time and place. Okay. Let's start leveling. Oh, we didn't get the the XP. That's bad. I I thought for sure he would get the XP for that, but he didn't. Okay, we got the burn, which is great. Um, we're definitely not catching a Lechonk. I'll be I'll be real. I'm saving. Should I save round? I don't know. I don't know what the the damage of round is. I would assume that it's, like, equal to or less than Tackle. Okay, pretty minimal damage. Thank you, Ember, for making that a possibility. We we really do be just doing that starter thing. <laughs> That's for certain. Okay, Rare Candy didn't revive, so we, we just gotta... We gotta spend... To my knowledge, there are no, um... There are no ways of healing your guys in this game, so... Or no, no uh, Poke Centers, so I'm, I'm going to assume that this is the correct move. And uh, I'm going to start feeding the hell out of Fue Coco with Rare Candies. And we'll see how that goes. It's a Sunkern boss, holy! Oh no, <laughs> not the, it's the boss Sunkern! Got him. Bodied. <laughs> okay. EXP charm, nice. Oh, there are heals. Oh, I feel so silly. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, well, I spent all my money. I spent literally all of my money on that dumbass play. Holy shit, I feel silly. Well, bright side, now we know. It's okay. This is my first run. I'm learning. This this is a learning process. It's not a big deal. My Fue Coco is overleveled. Everybody else is underleveled. You know how it is. Uh, I don't know anything about Young Goose, but I don't trust a face like that. I'll be honest. <laughs> not my president. <laughs> oh my god, that's a joke. I'm Canadian. <laughs> I just, just, it's, a, it's, it's a joke, okay? Don't cancel me. <laughs> there we go. Nice. Not too bad. And we've got all our uh, our power points back, which is even better. Mudkip took a bunch of damage there. Oh, God. No, Mudkip went down again. Well, I guess Mudkip's just never getting any XP at all. Fuck me. <laughs> I should have probably swapped out. It's uh, it's it's fine. We, we gotta get Grookey a, like a, a move that is effective. Because, like, that's, that's a problem right now. There we go. Level 6. And branch poke. That's that's what I was looking for. It's exactly what I was looking for. Very nice. Um. Oh. Well. Th th thank you, Luminessa. Thank you for the follow. That's been happening a lot more lately. I'm, I appreciate everybody who's been joining in on the, <clears throat> the all the all the Kadomon and Pokemon like action, all that sort of thing. It's been a lot of fun. We're, we're gonna take X Attack because that's that's great. Oh, that's a Palmy. Palmy's pretty great. Um. I would love to have a Palmy in the party. Quick attack. Okay, okay. That's a, a range on the kill. I'm going to go ahead and hit him with a tackle here. Just so we don't... Uh, oh my god. <laughs> the X attack. I didn't think about it. Shit. Oh, well, it's fine. With, um... Ooh, great balls. Uh... Yeah, I think I will. Wow, our money is our money is so low. This is a nightmare. We're going to. The, <laughs> I feel like I didn't let any of my other mons level up fast enough, and now I'm in trouble. 
I'm very much just in a a press mode, <laughs> which isn't great. I'll be the first to admit that. Here we go. Grookey's catching up. Cottony's catching up. Stun Spore is great. Golden Punch grants 50% chance of 50% of damage inflicted as money. God damn. Um, a revive would also be super nice, but we definitely need to start generating money. And we're going to put that on Grookey, because Grookey's going to be getting some farming in here soon. Here we go. Uh, nope, we are, we are staying as is. This is perfect. Okay. Uh, they're both level 9. We're just going <clears> to <throat> team one down. And hopefully that works out well. Ooh, that's scary. Uh, do I swap? Oh, no, I did the same thing again, where I don't know how to, like, B button out of this. What is the B button? Is it Z? It's not Z. Please, don't do this to me. Uh... I don't... Escape doesn't work. Is there, like, a... Controls? Game settings. Damage numbers should definitely be on. Uh... Okay. Hmm. There's there's a lot of settings here. Look at this. This is pretty sweet. Touch controls. Oh my god. You can play it on the phone. <laughs> oh my god. That's amazing. All right. Well, I think we're just going to get bodied here. I'm just going to have to accept my uh, my fate cuz I I didn't I I committed to attacking too fast. Which is unfortunate. Okay. Oh, the blaze. The big old blaze. I always forget Fue Coco is kind of slow. There we go. We didn't even need to switch Fue Coco out. Hey, we're getting bite. That's good. Get some variety in our moves. Okay, now we can finally get around. It's 60 versus 40. Okay, and it's special versus physical, so... Round is just better than tackle. Now I know. Now I know. You already knew that, probably. But I didn't. Here we go. I, I've i not played... Um, we got Taunt as well. That's pretty good. X-Defense. Ooh... Pretty good. I definitely need to potion up here, for sure. I'll do one of those. And I think X defense is just gonna be better. Okay. I'm not gonna bring Grookey in on this. I, I feel like grass types might be really bad and fire types might be really good in early game. It's kind of the vibe I'm getting. <clears throat> While we've got our X attack active, we should be using our, uh, our our physical moves more, I think. Unless X attack also does special attack, in which case then it doesn't matter. But I don't know if that's how that works or not. I'm not really sure. Uh, another potion would be great here, but we probably should try to avoid healing and try to buff up our party as much as we can. Like, if we can get this Meowth in the party, that would be good. Fake out is... Fake out technician! Oh my god! Oh my god, I'm getting bodied by this Meowth. <laughs> it's so good. Give it to me. I want it. I want this Meowth. I don't care if it, like, eats half my party. It's gonna be insanely strong. Holy shit, dude. What a banger setup. Give me a great ball. Come on. Come on, baby. Hell yeah, dude. This thing's gonna be a monster. Okay. Holy... Holy, look at look at these level ups. It's amazing. Meowth got XP off their own thing. We got a PP up. What would we want that on? Do we have any moves that that matters about? Um, I guess it would be nice on Fake Out, because we'd spam the heck out of that. It's like the only move I can think of right now that's like immediately really useful. Ooh, it's a Fletchender. Oh my god. Well, it's just a Fletchling for now, but it will be a Fletchender eventually. Okay, um, we're not gonna do that instantly. Let's fake out first. It's nice. 
And I guess a scratch or a faint would be good. We'll go for faint because it can't knock out. There we go. And since they're so low, we'll go for a Pokeball. Nice. It's... Good. it's, <laughs> it's okay. I don't, I don't know the natures well enough to know if that's a good one or not. But uh, I'm happy to have it. Okay, so what do we dump in our party for that? We've already got a normal type. Meowth is going to be way better than Minchino. I'm, I'm going to go ahead and release them. A part of me wants to get rid of Mudkip, but that, that's our only water type. So let's not do that. Grookey's going. Our poor Mudkip is being so neglected. I'm pretty sure it'll be able to catch up, though. So I'm not too worried. Another X attack going would be great. Um, I think we'll go for that. So we gotta keep in mind that there's like a boss, and then there's like a whole nother um or that like there's a trainer and then a boss, and those are two different things, which is kinda scary. Um this Meowth is gonna kick so much ass in the early game with Technician. For those of you who don't know what Technician does, it um Oh, Payday! Oh my god. Meowth is going to carry the shit out of me. This is amazing. Um, but yeah, if, if you don't know what Meowth, or what, what Technician does, it uh, makes it so moves under 60 base power are boosted to double. So, it's very, very good. Especially in the early game like this. Focus Band! Oh my god. It's the item. 10% chance to survive with 1 HP after being damaged enough to faint. It's uh it's pretty YOLO, but like it's it's kinda sick, right? It's kinda sick. Um we're gonna take the item off of Grookey. I don't know. I thought that would move the item off of Grookey. I don't think that's how that worked. Talo, level 13. We should be fine. Yeah, we're fine. Let's payday him. Get that money. Oh, no, he was faster. Oh, my goodness. I don't know, like, speeds super well in, in this video game, unfortunately. Um, I mean, we're lower level, so I'm going to hit him with the quick attack just to guarantee the hit. There we go. That seemed like the right call. Nice. Priority OP. Very nice. What do we got? A revive. We're probably gonna want a revive for, like, the boss fight, right? And Meowth has been proving really, really strong. Fue Coco is obviously great, too. I, th I think we'll go for the Fue Coco revive. Okay. <laughs> I regret not reviving Meowth. Um, I'm going to open Cottony, because I, I don't want to get, uh, I don't want to get bodied by this fake out, because I know it's coming. Let's Stun Spore. There we go. Maybe that'll help. Yeah, goodbye Cottony. Thank you for the Stun Spore. <laughs> That's the most I could have hoped for, honestly. And we have three turns of X-Attack. I'm, I'm pretty convinced at this point. Okay. Are we in blaze range? We are in blaze range. Let's go. Oh, Nelly. Okay. The, the para is not going off, which is a damn shame. This is looking kind of monka. <laughs> let's, let's bring on our Grookey here. And I guess we'll just hit him with a branch poke. We got... Yes, thank goodness. There it is, Overgrow, thank goodness. That was getting kind of monka. I'm sure we're doing really poorly early on here. But I, to be fair, I spent all of my money on revives at a really, really stupid time. That's my excuse, and I'm sticking to it. Also, it looks like Grookey just has two of the items on them now, which is interesting. It's a Growl, or a Houndor. I almost said a Growlithe, I would have imagined. I would have been cancelled immediately. Um, let's go ahead and swap out here. I was gonna bring in Mudkip, but, uh, he's, uh, he's level 6. <laughs> that's, maybe it's, that's my bad. Maybe, maybe I should be paying more attention to my little boy, but, you know, it just, it, ha it happens, you know? Sometimes it, 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 it gets away on you. Okay. That Houndor is in a very capt capturable range. 
I mean, what's the harm in throwing a ball, you know? I mean, <laughs> dude, the HP is overrated, right? Oh my god, he's, he's stacking up. Hang on, let's just throw a great ball. There we go. Let's, let's not worry too much. Minus attack plus diff. That's uh, it's a pretty awful nature. <laughs> it's kind of awful. I don't want to make room for Houndor, even though they're a high level. Let's go, Mudkip. Everybody's getting leveled up. Alright, and we got money. Get some more nuggets, some more great balls. Um, I'm feeling the nuggets worth 400 now. That's almost, like, that's half a revive, but I think the great balls are going to do me more good. Okay. Um, we have Water Gun and Rain Dance. We might just do. We just say Mudkip is good. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want him to go down again. It's gonna feel so silly. I'm gonna go for the fake out combo again. I, th I think they will. will probably be okay. There we go. Based Meowth with fake. Fake out is so good. Like holy moly. This Meowth is gonna kick so much ass. I like it. Normally Meowth is like kind of a shitter mon in modern day, but like in this situation it's pretty good. Who evolves from Sunstone in my party? Anybody? Let's see. Are you do do you do you just No. Yeah, I didn't think so. Why is Sunstone showing up? That's weird. Yeah, it's weird. We have like a good amount of balls. Uh I'll I'll take the money. Money is forever whatever. That's that's how they say that, right? <laughs> I don't think that's how they say Oh, they've got fake out too! God damn it! Oh my god. My meow. Uh, I, I am clearly just not very good at that Pokemon. I'm just gonna hit him with the ember. Hope we get the burn. It's all about that burn. Come on. Come, come on. Give me the burn. Please. There we go. I guess we're in blaze range now. Optimal. Optimum blaze range. Everybody loves it. Okay. All the all the non-used party members are catching up. Grookey's Grookey's getting razor leaf. All right. New new best party member. New new best party member just dropped. I'm getting rid of growl right away because I I don't I'm I'm a dummy and I don't use moves like that. Uh, super lure. Double battles. That is more XP, and we do have multiple... I feel like you're more likely to take damage in double battles. I'm gonna take the X attack. It's another one of these Glamios. Okay, I'm gonna bring out... Uh, the fact that they have Fake Out is the nastiest thing in the world. Like, what am I supposed to do about that? Okay. I guess we're, we're Razor Leaf spammers now. Holy crit, that's nasty, man. Oh my god, the damage... Uh, do we sack somebody? I don't know. I want to get Leech Seed on Cottony and have, like, j just be a troll. That's my dream. Oh, they just used Fake Out randomly. That's very dumb. <laughs> I'll, ta I'll take it, I guess. I don't know how much damage uh, Fairy Wind does, but... Maybe I should hit Stun Spore first. I don't think we Oko on a level 15, so we're gonna do that. I'm gonna Stun Spore first. And now we're going to go for Fairy Wind, I guess. Oh yeah, that's that's some awful damage. <laughs> some genuinely awful damage. Hey, para hacks, don't mind if I did. Good job, Cottony. Kinda clutch that one out for us. All right. Not bad. Not bad. We could get a uh, a couple heals going. Let's take it. Let's take a look at how everybody's doing. I think Grookey's like, yeah, literally on one HP. We'll just hit him with. Uh, we we can hit a couple potions here. That's fine. And we're just gonna leave that one mon dead. 
for the time being, my Meowth. I have to fall behind a little bit, sadly. But that's okay. Oh, it's Ivy again. Fancy meeting you here. Looks like you're still undefeated. Not bad. I know what you're thinking. And no, I wasn't creeping on you. I just happened to be in the area. I'm happy for you, but I just want to let you know that it's okay to lose sometimes. We learn from our mistakes, often more than we would if we kept succeeding. I can read. In any case, I've been training hard for our rematch, so you'd better give it your all. Alright, what do we got? They, they've got three mons now, and they've got a level 18 Marsh Tomp. That's terrifying. Um, I would love to land and absorb here, but we, we always stun spore first. That's that's always step one. How'd you miss stun spore? <laughs> How'd you miss stun spore? And I hit the move twice, so I gotta I gotta send it. Come on. Oh, rest and rip, Cottony. Alright, we don't have quad super fast. I guess we do have Grookey. That's fine. Um I would love to use my my Meowth here, but they're they're fucking dead. That's kind of a thing. They're going back out to their Marsh Tomp, of course. How dare they? How dare they? Are we are we in a, one of these situations where I'm, like, super out-leveled? What did I do wrong? Oh, that's a rock throw. And that's the wrong move. Okay. We don't have Absorb here. And they're, they're cheesing me out. I mean, it's not cheese. This is literally how you play Pokemon. But, like, also, they're, they were out-leveling me super hard. I don't know how they did that. I guess the answer is they have less guys. That that's that that could be the answer. Okay, we're gonna go for a bite because we we gotta start getting some real damage on the marsh tomp. And if a rock throw is incoming, then I'd mudkip mudkip is my sack, I guess. Um, rain dance ain't it? That's for certain. I'll I'll send the water gun. Who knows? Okay, yeah. I mean, that makes sense. Okay, so Grookey comes out. I swap... I, I double their double with Fue Coco. Alright. And now I... Do I double their double again? Or do I double Bite? I mean, I've already committed to Bite. Okay, there we go. They accepted that I, I got the double. I'm gonna hit round here. Oh, okay. Are they not going to swap again? Oh my god, they swapped on the Ember. They're literally reading inputs. Unbelievable. Okay. Um, who's my sack now? Fletching, Fletchling? Yeah, it is. Uh, that is the sack. Okay. Rock throw takes us out in one hit. Water gun almost takes us out, but that was a crit. Um, I'm happy with the quick attack here, I think. Just to get a little extra damage off. That's fine. Okay. Now, since I doubled them with Grookey once, Grookey's my win con. But I, I think I'm slower. I think I guaranteed lose. I'm pretty sure there's nothing I can do. I should be faster with, um... I, sh I should be faster with the para, yeah. So now, now it's just down to whether Grookey is faster or not. That's pretty much where we're at. And we did just level up twice, so... That might help a little bit. We'll see. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, we'll, we'll learn Incinerate. That's better than Tackle. Oh, man. Remember that I do have a 10% chance to just auto-win with Grookey because of Band. They've got Napsol and I didn't even realize it! They've just been doubling me on, like, the two basic mons they have. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so over. It's so unbelievably over. Okay. Um, incinerate me. Oh my god, the damage. Okay, Blaze, doing good. There's no reason for them not to end me here. But they decided not to anyway. Okay, Blaze looking pretty hot. We do not swap here, or we, we just, like, outright lose. Bite for flinch chance if we go first. We did not go first. Rest in peace, Fue Coco. All right, this is... All the marbles are on Grookey here. <laughs> okay. Um, Razor Leaf, come on, overgrow. Carry me. Hey, all right. 
giant XP drop. Huge XP drop. We're getting the our first evolution. Let's freaking go. Here we go. Grookey has evolved into Thwacky. Look at that. All right. Double hit. Yeah, you can have double hit over Scratch, I guess. <laughs> I'm keeping Taunt. Taunt's a good move. There we go. All right. Moment of truth. Am I faster? I'm faster. Let's fucking go. Not even close. <laughs> Alrighty. Wow. Out of nowhere, Thwacky hard carries. We we had to focus up there. I was I was really throwing it all at the wall there. I wasn't supposed to lose that time. Oh well. That just means I'll have to train even harder for next time. Also, I got you another one of these. No need to thank me. This is the last one, though. You won't be getting any more freebies from me after this. Keep at it. EXP all. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and <laughs> hit somebody with a revive here, I think. Let's get the uh, Fue Coco back on their feet. Oh, man. Oh, man. I should have done this differently, I think. We're gonna stay in as Thwacky. I think we'll be okay. We're in overgrow range, so we can really abuse that. More Pico is like very whatever to me. Uh, they have the speed. And there's not really much I can do about that. I'm just gonna have to eat the damage. Overgrow carry, for sure. We're, we're definitely just RTSRing our way through. Which is one way of playing the video game. I'm not learning Screech. What do you take me for? Sweeping moves only, obviously. <laughs> we, we only take sweeping moves, okay? <laughs> Fue Coco is evolving. Fue Coco has like really, really good signature abilities, so if I can get them maxed out to their, their oh my god, he looks so dumb. That's that's a middle phase if I ever did see. Like, goddamn. <laughs> First phase, cute as hell. Second phase, what the hell have they done to my boy? Third phase, oh, he's back to being cool. That's that's good. That's that's just how it always is. Don't ask me why. It's just how it is. We're gonna we're gonna potion up for the boss because I gotta I gotta put some respect because we we did almost get swap sw sw sweepy swooped. We almost got swept. That's the word. That's the word that almost happened. We're gonna rook handy up here as well. Um, Crocolord just leveled up, so that's good timing there. Thwacky wouldn't have gotten much benefit because they're already about to level up. Oh, that's a fur fru. I. I feel like this guy's got good stats or something, but he's another normal type. Um, yeah, I think I think he might have like a, a he's got like a special move that makes him really really tanky. But I think I think I, I don't remember. I I vaguely recall what this thing does. <laughs> it's it's like I have I have like a a weird semi memory where it's like is is this real? I don't know. Oh my god, no burns. No burns to speak of. We just lost all our HP again. Thankfully we're getting big level ups. Big level ups. Such huge level ups. Um, we're, we're, we're gonna super potion again. This isn't great. This is not great. It's another one! <laughs> oh my god. The struggle is real. Oh, they're using good moves now. That's not good. That's not good for me at all. Okay. Incinerate's definitely doing more damage. Bruh, they're headbutt flinching the heck out of me. Okay, let's use an Ember here. You say I attack? I mean, that's actually a good thing. I'm glad he did that. That's way better than anything else he could have done to me. We're getting so many level ups, it's crazy. Mainly because we only have two units alive in our party. That's a max revive. I would love to get, like, Meowth back on their feet. Okay. Um... We resist, but what do we do? Like, not much. I guess we'll go Meowth. For now. We, we, we fake out. Every day of the week. Any chance I get. Oh my god, the bite does so much damage. Um, we have to swap back into Crocolore. Worst case scenario, 
I get another fake out, I guess. Best case scenario, we live like that. And round is the only damage we're... Yeah, okay. Okay, that's that's fine. This is fine. We can just we can do the meow thing. Fake out. And I'm going to throw a ball, because it's faster. <laughs> it's the only reason. It's just safer than the being outsped. Um... Let's think about it. I might get rid of Fletchling. I I had visions of grandeur of like having like a crazy brave bird roosting just murderer on my team, but we're so far away from that that I I just need like a a guy that's alive. Honestly, that would that would hit the spot. <laughs> just a dude who's alive on my team would be way better at this point. Okay, we got a memory mushroom. Recall a Pokemon's forgotten move. I'm good. Max Potion seems excessive. Let's uh, think about potioning. Uh, we could potion you and then Max Potion you. Just so that way we got some party members to work with. It's Whitney! Oh god, what the hell? I didn't know I was gonna run into Whitney. What the fuck, man? Okay, it's... it's it, if it was over before, it's even overer now. This is the overest it's ever been. It's never been more over in my entire life. Okay, except if he wants to keep, keep using sleep talk, that's, that's amazing for me. Echoed voice gets stronger every time it gets used. Um, I didn't want to... I keep committing to a move. If I knew how to... If I knew how to, like, get out of this, that would be great. I'm, I'm like, hitting random buttons on my keyboard at this point. Like, I'm trying everything. I'm, I'm... Oh, oh, it's X! It's X! X is the answer. It's, we solved for X. Thwacky is our, like, big carry. We're, this is our pivot, let's be honest. He's got rest. This is a degenerate team. Oh my... He, he has ch resto chesto? He, he's a chesto set? You gotta be kidding me! Okay, leer me. Are they gonna swap on a leer? I don't know. Oh my crit! Gorgeous crit. Huge crit. Okay, they're swapping out. We gotta be ready to finish that off. I'm spooked. Smog me. Okay. Good, jo good job, Houndor. You did way better than you had any right to. <laughs> we can't do the fake out stuff. Um, what kind of shenanigan? I I feel like I need to taunt almost, but I I I just don't know what they do. I don't know. I have no idea what they could do. They could do anything. It's a it's a goddamn Clefable. It's got every goddamn move under the sun. Life do is an item, right? What? No, it's it's. Is it a move, bro? He's 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 tap dancing on my goddamn grave already. I did the ninety five percent is. What does life do? God damn it! We're fine. Everything's fine. Yes, thwacky! Keep on thwacking, my boy! The the clutchness. Meowth wants to learn bite, that would be good. That'd be some extra coverage. We're gonna get rid of Scratch for that. His payday's just better. Oh god! <laughs> it's, it's the mill tank! It's the mill tank! No, oh, it's over. It's over. <laughs> There's no way, dude. I had no idea this was coming. What was I supposed to do? Okay, just continually flinch forever. Never mind, he's faster. All right, there we go. Good job, Miltank. Good job, Whitney. I, I was not ready for a, a random Whitney. All right, that is, um, that's, that's Poke Rogue. That's my first little run. Obviously, there's a lot of improvements that I'm going to be able to make because I've, I've learned a lot. If you'd like to see more Poke Rogue, please let me know. Uh, I, I will be able to tell that you want more because there will be, like, a bunch of comments and, like, people are going to be liking it like crazy and, and, like, the subscriber numbers are going to go through the roof or whatever. That Then I'll be like, oh, man, I got to do some more of this or whatever, you know? But, yeah, very fun game. Uh... 
if you don't want to see it, I'm just going to play it myself. So, yeah. Maybe maybe make my addiction more worthwhile by liking the video. Okay, bye. <laughs> see ya.